Welcome back to our weekly environmental news report. Today is January 15, 2017. The U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service has designated the rusty patched bumblebee an endangered species, marking the first such declaration for a bumblebee species. Over the past two decades, the bumblebee's population has declined 87% due to loss of habitat, diseases, pesticides, and climate change. Some ways individuals can help protect bumblebees include planting native flowers, limiting or avoiding pesticides, and fostering natural landscapes. If we can save the giant panda, we can surely save the bumblebee as well. For those who are concerned about food waste but don't prefer the cumbersome composting process, here is some good news for you. Whirlpool's Zara Food Recycler is a new innovation that transforms food scraps into rich fertilizer in less than 24 hours. It is an automated appliance that stirs and aerates the food scraps. The Zara is designed to use an additional brown material made from coconut husk and baking soda, which rapidly speeds up decomposition of the scraps. An estimated 40% of food in the United States is wasted every year, with 95% of it going to landfills. So composting your food scraps is extremely beneficial for the environment. Although the Zara is pretty expensive at an early bird price of $700, traditional backyard or city composting is always available as well. For more than 250 days last year, renewable energy supplied 98.1% of Costa Rica's electricity. The country of 4.9 million people gets most of its electricity from large hydropower facilities, which are fed by multiple rivers and heavy seasonal rains. Costa Rica's smaller economy and natural resources give it an advantage over an energy-hungry nation like the U.S. For Costa Rica, the clean energy success story is likely to continue into 2017, with four new wind farms being built. Wow, I bet Costa Ricans enjoy things like air conditioning without feeling guilty. Remember the Volkswagen emissions scandal last year? Now Fiat Chrysler has been accused by the EPA for cheating on its diesel emissions testing by using secret software applications in multiple models, which lowered the emissions of nitrogen oxides during testing. The EPA alleges that by failing to disclose this software and then selling vehicles that contained it, Fiat Chrysler automobiles violated important provisions of the Clean Air Act. However, the car company believes that it met all the applicable requirements. There is currently an ongoing investigation. Bioengineers at the University of Nottingham are testing how to use shrimp shells to make biodegradable shopping bags as a green alternative to plastic and as a new food packaging material to extend product shelf life. Kaidozen, the same stuff in fat binders, is a human-made polymer derived from the organic compound chitin, which is extracted from shrimp shells. Dried chitosan flakes can then be dissolved into solution and polymer film made by conventional processing techniques. Dr. Nicola Everett, who leads the study, plans to approach UK packaging manufacturers with the product. That's all for this week's environmental news report. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel.